vaccination is the the biggest key we have to preventing um, pertussis. Stephanie Vogel is director of population health. She says the warning is needed because of a troubling trend they are seeing. In 2017, there were 140 cases. In 2018, only 10. And then last year, back up 40% to 14 cases. What we saw in 2019 is that number of cases, they all occurred in a really short period of time. And so that makes, makes us concerned. What caused that huge reduction between mm -hmm. 17 and 18? You know, I think there was a lot of information at that time and a lot of education going on because there were so many folks affected. There is also a push now to get booster shots for teens and adults. What we see with pertussis is that the um, vaccination tends to wane over time. So folks, when they start to get into those preteen and teenage years and into the adult years, should really start talking to their provider about a booster vaccine. Vogel says some people can have a cough anywhere from four to six weeks, and that's why it's important to check with your doctor so you can get some antibiotics that you can take for at least five days. I'm Curtis Fuller, WLWT News 5.